Hi everybody, welcome to Project Servertopia. My name is Eric and today we're going to do a little bit of an unboxing with this item right here. This is the Lego Travel Companion, item number 5004932. Now it was included as a freebie from the Lego store, and I guess also lego.com, uh, free with a $35 or more purchase throughout the month of June. And it has an approximate value of $6.99 in the U.S., $9.99 in Canada. Now, I got this a couple of three weeks ago when I purchased the Parisian restaurant. And I haven't assembled that yet. I guess that's going to be in its own little video, <laughs> maybe a two-parter. It looks pretty big. But uh, anyway, I figured you know, now's a good time to, to open this up and, and see what's in it. And I uh, figured you know, I'd share this with y'all so y'all can you know, open it up with me. Uh, that is the whole point of an unboxing video, is it not? But uh, anyway, I do want to give a quick shout out to Lego Store 754. You know, y'all rock. I'm just saying. Um, now, you open it up and it has, oh, it has this little nice little suitcase look to it. And you see, yeah, I'm just putting it up there very close to the to the camera so you can see and you can see the straps have the little lego studs on them which i think is pretty cute and of course you have to have a lego sticker and a lego land because you know if you're traveling you might as well make it lego land and also in new york now i had to figure out what this was this is obviously an airport code and bll actually is short for billund airport or if you're in if you speak danish it's uh billund lufthaven I hope that's how you pronounce it. But anyway, uh, that is an airport in Denmark. It is uh, very close to Legoland Billund, which is the largest tourist attraction in Denmark outside of Copenhagen. So that's your little bit of unboxing trivia for the day. All right, so let's get this suitcase open and see what we got inside, shall we? You can tell this is the first time that it's really been opened because... <gasps> The plastic bag has not been opened. Yeah, so we've got the bag. And oh, look, you know, it's, it's a dangerous world. You have to take your teddy bear with you, you know. I do like this. I do like the way that this has been printed up. And it looks like the, the suitcase and just got everything in it. It's just very cute packaging. And, of course, if you're a traveling companion... You have to have a passport. Just gotta. Now, this is probably more current than mine. I think mine expired several several years ago. And of course, you have to have you know your identification because you know they say yo, who are you? I am I am Mr. Blake Lego Face. Yeah, <laughs> that doesn't work. Oh, oh yeah, you're supposed to draw your thing. So it's like okay, I think I'll put in Salvador Dali mustache. Then I'm impressionist man. Oh, and these are of course the instructions for assembling all the other stuff and you know pictures photo gallery oh ice fishing yeah gotta love that and let's see what is what is that that is it's fishing on top of a flower pot maybe okay so yeah more pictures there's a lot of fishing pictures in here I don't know if you noticed that Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, swing for the cheap seats there, bud. Alrighty. And that's all of them. Okay, so we're going to set this to the side so we can use our instructions later on. And these are, what are these? I'm not 100% sure what these are, unless they're just like, word captions or or whatever maybe so we're gonna set these to the side as well and we're gonna have to do something about securing this workspace table this work board down to the thing but anyway we cannot get into this bag right here without the help of your friendly neighborhood pair of scissors I'm gonna go run with them later because you know I'm a rebel that way so we open them up, and boom, uh, we see, let's see what we got in here. Of course, we've got, we've got a fish, a fish, of course, so you can do all those fantastic fishing pictures. 
You've got a suitcase, which, of course, you know, if you're a traveling companion, you got to have a suitcase. And i got to have that put to the side because that is going to blow away. Um, nice little satellite dish. Clearly, some kind of boogie board, snowboard. Helmet. You got to have your helmet when you're snowboarding. And uh, with some of the things you're going to try to catch, you probably should do it with fishing too. So, all right, here's our traveling companion torso, our traveling companion turquoise pants. Or are these aqua? I think that's aqua. What would you, what would you, say? and I got to get it right in front of the camera. I'm still getting used to this part. Okay. Yeah, I think those are aqua. So, we're going to put the pants on the shirt. And the torso. Yeah, there we go. There we go. And there's the guy's head, your traveling companion head. Let's see if we get him a good shot up there. Yeah, there we go. Come on, focus. Focus. Focus, Daniel san. Focus power. Okay, so there's his head. Very, very simple head. And no, they don't. Ha this one is not one that has two faces on it. So we're going to put this guy together. Oh, yay. See, there he is. But wait, there's more. He has to have his lime green ball cap. There, he is ready to play. He is ready to companion you as you travel the world. Yeehaw. So, all right, we've got put him to the side. And let's see what else we got to do here. Oh, yes. There is the little sand castle part right here. So let's assemble the sand castle. Let's see. Calls for the two by two plate. Yes, two by two plate. We have our two by two plate. Um, we have our little. Cylinder cone piece right there. Yep. So we put it right there. And we have a couple of uh, one by one 45 degree angle pieces. Put that there. And put that there. Yeah, there we go. Yay. So we're, we're, we're almost there. We're almost done. We're on the home stretch. We gotta have a stick. We gotta have a stick. Yes. We have a stick to put in our cone. Yes. A stick to put in the cone. Yeehaw. Now, what goes better with what goes good with a stick? Walking softly. But in Lego, you get a little flag. So you put your little flag on the stick, on your little sandcastle. So you can claim the sandcastle in the name of France. Or if you're playing with Lego, Denmark. We're going to put that down with our little traveling companion. And uh, let's see. What is... Oh, this... I, I see what this is. This right here. It's it's like a little travel grill complete with weenie. Because when you're traveling the world, you want to have your ability to cook your hot dog. So, now we have that. We need... Wait a minute. Oh, there we go. We have our two by two plate with the center hole. Let's see. Can we get it to where you can see it? You can kind of see it. Oh, 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 there we go. There we go. There's your hole in the middle. There's a hole. There's a hole. There's a hole in the bottom of the sea. But let's see. What else do we have? Well, we've got the little, the little bowl part to the grill. Yeah, let's see it. Of course, you can't see it. I would have to choose a black background. But that's okay. We got it. We can put that on top. Now we got to find our grill cover, and I'm thinking it this right here. Yes! Yes, it is. You can see. Yay! Yay. Come on. Focus. 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 Okay, this is this is what I get for having the webcam. 
All right. So we put it on top of the little bow thing, and boom, there's our little travel grill. You know, I don't think they'll let you bring this on a uh, on a flight because, you know, they, they want you to pay $15 for the pack of peanuts. Yeah. So anyway, I'm going to set that down with him. Oh, 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 you got to have the hot dog. Got to have the hot dog, you know. Bun length. We're going to put that on top of him. There we go. And let's see, what else we got to put in here? Oh, we got to have the selfie stick. Yeah, of course, you can't. You can't be a world traveler without a selfie stick, because you know there, there it is. There's your selfie stick, right here. So you take your little, your little tripod, your little stand. Well, you can't really call it a tripod because it's got four legs. A quadruped, maybe. You know. Will that make it a quadruped? And of course, here's your camera, a little bitty camera. And we put the camera on the quadrupod. <laughs> quadrupod. That does not look like that fits. It does not look like that fits, but apparently it does. And boom, there you have, you know, here, let's see, let's put this here. There you go. You can see it a little better. Yeah. Kind of any, anyway. Yeah. Yep. Yep. There we go. So we're going to put that next to our travel companion. What's next on our, oh, the satellite dish is a nice, lounge chair can you see that it's a nice lounge chair that's pretty simple that's going to take most of our pieces though all right so we take our little hinge piece hinge piece and put it here like so and oh yeah we got to put a little foot thingy on it otherwise he'd be at a slant and and who would want that? Yeah. And let's see. Of course, got to have the headrest. Headrest. Um, got to have the cup. Red Solo cup. I fill you up. Let's have a party. A Lego party. And you got to have the umbrella stand because that's what the satellite dishes for it's for the umbrella it's a parasol i guess you would call it all righty and there we go nice little it can you know move around yeah you want this i don't i want to be in the sun so we'll just move that back there oh but then again you get thirsty and you get one in the shade so there you go so we're gonna put this down by him, and uh, you know, hey, we're gonna put him on his little chase lounge thingy. Uh, let's see. Uh, oh, no, no, no! He, they don't like to lay flat. So there we go. There we go. And he's just chilling, maxing, relaxing, that sort of thing. Alrighty. And that really is all of the instructions. That's the end of them. And so, I guess what we need to do here, oh, oh, and we do have an ice cream cone. Ice cream cone and ice cream, vanilla. I guess they they really do like their vanilla ice cream there if you're in the Lego people. Legoland. Legoland vanilla. I wonder if you go to Legoland for real and they serve you an ice cream cone. Do they serve it up looking like this? I'm just wondering. Would they? They ought to, because that would just be so cool. It's kind of like, <gasps> I'm eating a real Lego piece. So, so we got that, and let's see. Uh, we did the snowboard. Oh, flippers. He's got to have flippers. Yeah, got to have them flippers. Flippers for when you go Lego scuba diving. Oh, this I know what this is now. This is the selfie stick. This is the selfie stick for the camera. 
So you take it off the little quadrupod here. And you put it there. Isn't that lovely? Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, black background. Yeah. There we go. Isn't that lovely? Hmm? Isn't that delightful? I'm going to blow up the Earth with my Q-36 explosive space modulator. Sorry, I just tend to go into random character voices, and, you know, Marvin's one of my favorites. So I guess this, uh, yeah, here's our helmet. Oh, no, this is not a, this is not a helmet. This is a snorkel. This is a snorkel. So, yeah, there you go. It's not a crash helmet for snowboarding. It's a uh, scuba helmet. Because you see, you've got the, got the little snorkel right here. Yeah, you can see right here. Yep, yep, yep. So, it's a little translucent plastic, so, you know, because you can see. You see, he's got the little little goggles there. So, all right, there you go. And now they put this as the fishing rod, but, you know, it looks more like Catwoman's whip. And uh, no, nobody's starting World War III outside my door. It's This is uh, being filmed on July the 4th, so people are shooting out fireworks, even though it's not really even dark yet, because America! So anyway, so yes, it's whip fishing. I guess this is how your know, cat woman goes, you know, fishing for dinner. <laughs> And uh, this, I'm going to be honest, I have no real idea what this is supposed to do. Let's, let's look and see what we have in the pictures. And once again, I have got to put that down. So let's, let's start at the beginning of the pictures. Okay, that's, there's the selfie stick. Yeah, selfie sticks. Yeah, I got nothing. This is not really showing us anything that that, that big, long Lego stick would go for. If you know what that stick is for, please put it in the comments below. Because, you know, my curiosity is, is it, it's peaked now. I got I to gotta know what that does. And uh, I do know what this does, though. This is the bits... These are the bits for the bucket. You know, in case, you know, in your trap viewing companion, you have a lot of destinations on your bucket list. Yes, that's that's a very corny joke. I, I am a dad. I, it's kind of like a contractual obligation to do corny dad jokes. And you, you'll get plenty of them. So there, there's the, there's the lovely bucket for catching all the fish that you catch with your whip. So we'll put that there. And, of course, I guess we need to close up the suitcase because, you know, who wants to leave your suitcase open for great lengths of time? Because, you know, cats can get into it and, and want you to take them places with you. I'm guessing I don't have a cat. I know plenty of people who do, and they tell me that. So I'm just going to take their word for it. Now we have this spot right here. Oh, uh-oh, Hello. It's a target? Why are we going targeting? Oh, I get it. I get it. I know. I know. Once you catch the fish with your whip, you throw the fish at the target and see if you can score a bullseye. Okay, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. That is. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, the Lego Traveling Companion. Uh, once again, that's item 5004932. Oh, snap, and I didn't notice this at the very bottom. So there we go. We get just one last thing that I didn't notice until the very end of the video. Yay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and look, you got to have your smartphone. I wonder if you have a voltage adapter for it. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you for uh, watching the video. And 
If you like the video, please be sure to, uh, to give us a like and give us a subscribe to this channel and you'll get notifications when more video content like this gets posted. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day. See ya.